Dashboard. A dashboard is a graphical user interface that organizes and presents information in a clear and concise manner. Dashboards are commonly used to display real-time data and statistics, such as performance metrics, key performance indicators, and other important information. Dashboards can be interactive, allowing users to filter and drill down into the data for more detailed analysis. From to-do list, you can view your pending works. If your taxi noises or supply noises are outstanding, you can view from. You can view expired quotations and you can follow up them. If you have any customer notes, when you create your customers, you can add customer notes. Those details you can view. From banking, you can view your bank balance movement. From sales history, you can view your monthly sales and you can compare with previous year sales. And when you move to that bus, you can view that month and sales. And also, you can drill down this sales history. You can view top customers by sales and you can customize this widget. You can view grid view or you can view as a chart. You can view customer name and sales. You can change these settings. You can enter how many numbers of customers you want to view. And you can view current year data or current month data. If you want to include credit note, you can check this option. After that, click Save Settings. Now you can view six customers. You can view customer balances this outstanding. You can view profit and loss. You can change settings. You can set current year or current month. You can select based cost of sales on purchases or sales. And you can view supplier balances, this outstanding, top selling items. You can view grid view or chart view. You can change settings. You can display as current year or current month, or you can view by unit or value. And if you want to include credit notes, you can check this option. You can set number of items from this drop down menu. After that, you can save.
you can view daily sales by clicking this bars you can drop down if you want to view details you can click details you can view the source document by clicking that bars You can customize your dashboard from dashboard options. Click add widget. Here you can add required widgets. And if you want to remove any widget, you can uncheck that widget. If you want to add any widget, you can check that option. You can check the widget name. And save. You can change the positions by drag and drop. Like that, you can customize your dashboard. If you have add any nodes to your customer or supplier, it will display in the dashboard. You can add nodes to customers. Select nodes and you can enter notes and on action date it will display in the dashboard you can add notes to your documents and those documents notes also display in the dashboard by clicking options and you can add document notes interaction date and note Those nodes will display in the dashboard. If you have add any anticipated payment dates for customer invoices, those details will display in the dashboard. You can add anticipated payment dates from options. Select anticipated payments. You can add anticipated payment dates. choosing the dashboard you want to display only users have the option to choose the dashboard they want to display when logging into the system to access this function select administration select my profile select the preferences tab from default dashboard display drop down menu, you can select the dashboard.
after that save